Hey guys and welcome to another how to video. This time it's to how to set up a Dazzle DBC 100. Obviously the first uh, and then we'll get now we'll get to the things that you need. First thing obviously you need a Dazzle, Dazzle DBC 100. You can get the platinum and the regular Dazzle. It doesn't make a difference. Second thing you'll need splitters. There are two kinds of splitters that I know of. Um, some are longer, like with this same thing at the top, but then longer, kind of like a uh, like a wire. Um, I chose this one because I found them at Radio Shack, and uh, you absolutely need these. Um, they're about three dollars each, so yep. All right, you need three of them. Second thing you'll need is a dual-ended uh, RCA cables. I think they're called. Um, Dual ended, it doesn't matter how long they are, actually. They kind of do, they kind of don't. Okay, next thing you, the first thing you need to do is put in your, um, things. Your, uh, your, your splitters. And you'll put them into the back end of your TV. Wait, actually the first thing you can do is uh, just go ahead and plug these in. How to do this one right here. Alright. Uh, you can put in the red one first. Doesn't matter which one you put in first. Only put in one though. One. And then you'll get the other one. They're not color coded. White. Yellow. And that's how you do that. Second thing you'll need to do is uh, end up your PS3 cable. Um, uh, the PS3 should, the PS3 should already have this, um, and then, uh, to plug into your TV, and you plug it into the other side of these things. So, for the white one, for the white one, you could just put in the, uh, PS3 white one, and then you'll be done with this one. Second, you'll get the red one. Plug it in right next to the other red one. And then finally, the yellow one. And that's how you do that one. Next, you'll do is to plug them in. Um, make sure they're plugged in really good, though. So, now, I'll put the red one in first. In the back of these, so they just put the red ones and put them right there. Next, let's get the yellow ones, actually, the white ones. Plug them in and the yellow ones, and make sure they're plugged in good. Okay, now next, you'll need. The other end of the <coughs> RCA cables, and plug them into the dazzle. All right, so this one is actually color coded. So that one right there, um, the S video slot, um, unless you want it there. If you want to uh, put get one of those. Uh, you can put them. I don't, but um, cause I don't think it makes much of a difference. Actually, the red one. There's a lot of plugging in and a lot of forcing. Okay, and then when you're done with that part of uh, plug it, in, plug it in. Uh, when you're plugging this in, you are done with the dazzle part right for this part, and then you will go. To this and now what you want to do is plug this thing in it'll make that noise actually you don't have to do that first but just to finish with something um you'll get a DVD thing and uh, you plug put it in and you install it and everything and when you're installed it uh, these two things might it will pop up sometimes if your computer doesn't allow it it won't allow it but uh, my computer allows it, so I can. So 
Uh, that's that. And, uh, you will go to... Okay, so there is two places, there is two places to, um, uh, these things. Uh, the best one I use is, uh, Pinnacle Instant Download. Uh, you're gonna download this one. You can download both. It'll say right there. It says download, uh, Pinnacle Instant. Um, Instant or um, Pinnacle Studio 12. Uh, Pinnacle Instant, uh, this one is way better. A wizard thingy will pop up right there and it'll say uh, to go to Advanced Menu or uh, Regular. You're going to go to Advanced Menu because it has everything right here. And when you're Advanced Menu, say Never Show the Screen Again. And you go there and um, actually, let me turn on my PS3. It's gonna take a while. <clears throat> Alright, up here you're gonna have to make sure it says Pinnacle, uh, uh Dazzle DBC 100. And, uh, right there. And this stuff will pop up right there. Uh, it should say something here. Uh, I think it'll be 15 minutes, but, uh, uh, da -da -da. put 113 so you'll never run out of time. Uh, I think it'll be on good. Uh, you're gonna make sure it's on best uh not better or uh, yeah just good best um you're gonna click it over here because you don't need any of this stuff and right here you can browse what i did uh in libraries i went to videos my public videos and i just made dazzle vid one uh, up to four and then I, this is for computer gameplay uh minecraft intro i haven't really made that so i should make one <laughs> but uh yeah uh also if you have a mic on documents, I put one that says my microphone, and I have first voice, second voice, and third voice, and I just save them onto this one. But I have uh, this stuff saved up to. Uh, this stuff is saved in uh, my videos on the first one, and whichever one you want to actually. This sh should be a Dazzle DBC 100, um, and then you'll just click this. All right, so when you're on. Uh, your PS3 and you want to record uh, just click start and you'll start recording it, it won't unless you're using uh, Pinnacle Studio 12 your voice won't, your voice won't record um, it won't record at the exact same time uh, so uh, your voice would just wouldn't record actually so what I did I just put the mic menu right there put it right here and when I start it I wait till it's zero and I start doing this uh... It's, it would record my voice right when this stuff is moving so they're at the exact same time so they're at the exact same part uh... you just click this to stop recording and uh... stop recording it will say right there and you're here to start over or to um... exit uh... just click exit and then uh, you should did i save it? i'm not sure if i even saved it Alright, I saved it. You will go to your uh, documents, videos, wherever you saved it, and this will pop up. You click on it twice, and then the video should pop up somewhere over here. You double click it, and it'll take you to Windows Live Movie Maker. You can add captions. Oh, yeah, sometimes that pops up, but, um, yeah. Cap captions, titles, and stuff. And, uh, the video will be right here. You can look through it. And uh, right now, since I didn't have any voice on it, so uh, it, it'll be normal. Uh, so right here, just go to click on YouTube. It'll say 640 for whatever. I'm just going to click this. for some. Uh, I just want to test it out. Uh, and then it should pop up. It'll say uh, my password. Did I even click it right? Yeah. And then, uh, just put it, uh, and the description will be blah, tags will be PS3. Here you have to put gaming. For me, it only allows me to put up to, uh, three, maybe four, sometimes, depends how long they are. I'll tag, and I don't know why. But, it, whoops, and there, it should be saving movie. It takes about, uh, I bet, a, mi a minute or two. I'm just going to pause the video so it'll go straight to the other part. Okay, so if you did it correctly, it, it also, it'll be saving. And then it'll switch to another thing that says publishing and you'll let it go there. This thing should pop up. Just put close. You don't need that. 
and uh, you can exit out if you feel like it or whatever. Um, go to Internet Explorer. Just wait for it to render, and then uh, you'll be able to watch it. Go up here, Video Manager, and the PS3 thing will be right here. See, and there it is on YouTube. Sometimes it'll have to render. It depends how long it is, but um, there. I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. Uh, this thing was a long time to put together, so. This is the last part of it, and um, I'm just going to delete this video. Actions, uh, delete, delete. Okay, so I'm um, back to the regular. Delete this from my stuff. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoy. Stay tuned for more how-tos. Actually, yeah, there's one more how-to that's going to pop up. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.